officials of Yobe State Government, World Health Organization, United Nations Children Fund, polio survivors, among other partners, take to the streets of Damaturu, the state capital, to commemorate the World Polio Day. Recent data from the Yobe State Government says there are four cases of polio in the state, a cause for great concern as it represents setbacks after years of being polio-free. We need to do more uh, in reaching uh, the people to uh, create awareness for them to know. Uh, three or four LGS of Machina, uh, Yusupari, uh, I think uh, Gujiba, Bursari and Gulani uh, have reported cases of uh, circulating variants polio. Uh, and I think this is a, a quick work of call for all of us. You see, all the partners are here, including our uh, for survival, to help to create awareness to the people. They have seen the impact. Their family has seen the impact. We have seen the impact of all your on them. And I think we don't want any other child in Nigeria to have this kind of uh, problem. We are patronizing uh, very closely and strongly with the state government and other partners for strengthening P primary health care as well as routine immunization and also a very strong investment in polio eradication initiative. So we are calling on our, the government and other partners and especially the communities too to join us into the fight of eradicating polio in the, in the country as a whole because it's not a one-man show. Everybody, all hands must be on deck. The development partners who pledge their support for the Yobe State government also seek for an increase in routine immunization, especially in remote communities. Today marks an important day for everybody to come out and um, our common goal is to end polio. So today we also commend the commitment of the state government to ensure that um, polio is eradicated entirely from Nigeria. And this cannot be achieved without a proper sensitization, community engagement, and also expanding the vaccination coverage. As per partners, all the international, the UN organizations, and then the local NGOs, we are all partnering with the government, and then with also community leaders, and then up to the community level, in order to uh, do awareness campaigns, and then to do vaccination campaigns across all the crannies and nooks in the, in the state. And then we are also advocating for improved routine immunization because it is when we strengthen routine immunization and then we also uh, do our surveillance of uh, vaccine preventable diseases. And then when we also do massive campaigns and then if every one of us and then and the children are all vaccinated, we'll be able to uh, prevent polio uh, infection. It's hoped that the recent robust sensitization embarked upon will forestall further outbreak of polio in the state.